Come in. Hello, you all right? Yeah, Craig, I'm, I'm a bit upset. I'm a bit annoyed that you keep using my pre-workout samples. So um, I've actually got no. you something else. Oh, hang on. We've done this one before. Oh. Cut. Okay. <laughs> Yo, yo, yo! Yo, what's up? I got the bomb pre-workout. Oh, are you talking about this one? The bomb? <laughs> nah, fuck that off. H-bomb. <laughs> Hello, guys. Jesus. Welcome back <laughs> to yet another one with us, the Review Bros, and we want to welcome you back if you've been here before or if you're new to the channel. Hello. We do pre-workout reviews and supplement reviews. We come in peace. We do. And today we have something very exciting. Very exciting indeed. And that is Red, White and Boom. H-Bomb edition. Yeah, not the normal, guys. So uh, stay tuned while we get into this. It's going to be uh, explosive. To say the least. <laughs> and please do hit the subscribe button, like the video, and let us know if you've tried this or the original. Yeah, cheers, guys. Okay guys, part one of this review is the taste and the mixability segment. We have this in uh, what flavour? We've got Blue, Blue Angels. Angels. And it also comes in Star Spangled Sours. How about that for a tongue twister? Yeah, that sounds nice to be fair though. I'll say that with a lisp. <laughs> yeah, good luck. Um, let's do it. Let's see it. The flavours might be a bit hard to sort of figure out what's where because um, Merrick Labs don't actually stock this anymore. No, they discontinued it, guys. Obviously, DMHA is present in this product, so if you have any sort of uh, doubt at all, then do not take this product. Absolutely. freaking lootly We'll move into that in the label, but DMHA obviously is a powerful stimulant, guys, that is a grey area ingredient. Yeah. We'll save that. Let's do it. Yeah, it looks good. I should have peeled these labels off, but it looks oh, good. Shit, yeah. <laughs> looks very good. Yeah, you'll have to take our word for it, guys. That's really good. And it doesn't even look like they've coloured it either. No, it don't at all. No. So they're worried about colouring, but then they throw DMHA in it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Irony. Irony. Yeah, let's do it. Anyway, yeah. Blue Angels going down the hatch. Is it godlike? Is it heavenly? Hmm. Not bad, not bad at all. I like that. Tastes it's like, like a lemonade -y sweet. Mm. Yeah. Nice, really nice. Mm. I've got a score in mind. Oh, I'm between two numbers, I don't know. Mm. Mm, okay. Do you want to count? Yeah. Three, two, one. Nine, nine, nine out, out of ten. ten. Oh, you did it. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, because I thought mixability is good as well, and it is good. It is good. It's very, very, very doable. Refreshing. So, uh, well done. All right, guys, money talks. You want to know if it's good bang for buck? Let's do it. Let's delve into the price of the product. Now, we're going to start off straight away by thanking powermyself.com for sending it over to us. Find them on Instagram at Power Myself Supplements. Uh, you know, great guys. They do this product. They do a whole range of products for really affordable prices. So do go and check them out. So sought after US products. Yeah, this being one of them, which is very difficult to get hold of now. Obviously, American Labs have stopped producing this product. So, you know, it's down to the last uh, bare... Scrapings. Yeah, units around. Just hunt it while you can. Mm. Now, obviously, that's a UK site. It's the UK people. You're looking at paying around 44 99 for the 20 servings that come in this container. So yes, that's right, it is a very expensive product. But it's one of those ones where you could be paying what you're, uh, what it's worth almost, let's yeah. just say, put it like that, and the rarity and you know the novelness uh, behind it. Yeah. Now, price per serving, you'll be asking, comes in at a whopping two pounds and 25 pence per go. Oh, that is expensive. So that is, yeah. As Craig puts it, damn expensive. Premium if we're using a nice word. And it scrapes in at a three out of 10 on our consistent price and scale. Just. So yeah, premium product, premium ingredients, potentially premium effects, wait till the end of the review. Yeah. So you might be paying what you're getting. 
the good thing about it is it's a genuine 27. It's not a 40 or 20, it's 20. Yeah. Um, but for you US guys, just for the sake of price comparison, it'll probably be cheaper over there anyway because you won't have, have the import in and export in Palava. It'll just be there. But it would work out as $59 or $2.95 a go based on the website we're rolling with. Yeah, so again, that's obviously the 3 out of 10 consistent pricing scale. Shop around, see where you can find it cheapest. Let's move into the label. It's an exciting label, guys. You're probably wondering what separates this from the original. Let's be doing it. <laughs> right, 21.3 gram scoop, quite a big ass yeah, scoop. Yeah, love it. First up, we start off with L-citrulline, two to one. That's the malic acid version, eight grams. Boom, that is a huge dose, guys. We love it, that's a great start to this label. Obviously, that's gonna be responsible for building nitric oxide levels up in the blood, and it's gonna induce some nasty pumps. I'll say that's a great start to this label, and that is a very healthy dose. Smashed it, and it continues into creatine monohydrate at five grams. <sighs> that is fantastic, guys. That's the full clinical dosage of creatine you know, per day, which is very, very rare in a pre-workout to see the full dose. So you're not actually gonna even need to supplement with another creatine product alongside this. It's gonna deliver it all in one hit. Now, what I'll say, that's obviously responsible for strength and power output as well as the muscle endurance and it, it loads the water the muscle cell with water and, and nutrients giving it that nasty pump so great stuff lovely we'll take that and then into beta alanine at 3.2 grams again smashing the dosages here that is the full clinical dose that's going to be responsible for that itchy tingly feeling you get when you take a pre-workout some of us love it we do um it obviously builds up in the system as well to enable muscle um, endurance down the line by buffering lactic acid so it's a great ingredient to have looking good so far moving into l tyrosine at 1500 milligrams keeping it really good with these dosages guys that is really in the sweet spot area it's going to help with focus concentration and coordination it's that lovely amino acid it's one of our favorite ingredients and that's a good dose lovely working with that is choline bitartrate at one gram again guys smashing these dosages when used to seeing about 500 milligrams so they're doubling yeah. up here again that's going to link with the l-tyrosine to give you some improved focus in the gym lovely and then caffeine and hydra slapping it in there with 450 milligrams that is a hefty dose of caffeine guys roughly four and a half cups worth of coffee the main stimulant that's going to really drive your gym session into the future boom and then the main one is the dmha at 200 milligrams let's be having ya <laughs> this is a powerful powerful stimulant guys obviously this is the one we mentioned is that gray area ingredient so if you're not sure about taking it then we'd recommend don't do it but if you do want to try it prepare for powerful stimulation guys yep eyeballs will be open for sure then we move into fear bromine 99 100 milligrams again a nice dose guys it's the ingredient that in chocolate that dogs cannot digest what will it do for you well it'll improve your mood that mood elevation ingredient happy times ahead moving into hardening hcl 50 milligrams a bit of stimulation there guys as well as improving the metabolization giving you that fat burning effect so it's going to work well with the caffeine to really get you some moving it's a movement. Nice. And Jesus Christ, Hoopazia serrata extract, leaf and stem, Hoopazia at 10 milligrams. That's the highest dose I've seen, I think. Yeah. Guys, that is a huge dose. I'm guessing because it's le leaf and stem, it may not be as potent, but 10 milligrams is going to really help with that focus and concentration. Obviously, it's dubbed the learning chemical uh, in that it helps the brain really get that focus on. You won't be forgetting what set you're on, three or four. <laughs> and that does actually tie it up. There's no digestion aid, but tell you what, those dosages are arousing. Yeah, that is a banging label, guys. Let's move into the effects. Okay, guys, we're going to move into the important part of this review, obviously the effects section. How do we honestly feel it in the gym? Now, we've used this one actually several times. Yeah, and that's a good sign that we've enjoyed a, a pre-workout if we keep going back to it to get a feel for it, you know? Yeah, let's start off obviously at the beginning. Um, the beta alanine dose is good. But you don't, but I don't feel it as much as you'd expect. I knew you was going to say that. Absolutely. <laughs> and I think that's because of the very well-dosed other ingredients sort of take a front seat. Yeah. And there is one other thing, I think. Lack of digestion aid. Yeah, no black pepper, no astrogen. Um, so there isn't that digestion aid to get it into the system as fast as possible. And saying that, it's a 21 grand scoop, isn't it? And you don't struggle with digestion. No, not really. It still goes into the system pretty nicely. Yeah. There isn't any, like, uh, like Craig says, any digestion Doesn't issues. sit on your stomach, does it? So. But I just think that beta alanine isn't absorbed as rapidly as it could have been. Yeah. So there isn't really a beta alanine feel. I there think is a, a bit. bit. Yeah, you know it's in there, but you're not like, Jesus. Yeah. And it is well dosed, so it's not it's not the case that it's not in there. It's working definitely behind the scenes. Um, the energy is a standpoint, um, you know, focus. Well, not focus, but a standpoint. Um, Factor. Yeah. You feel it, that, that high caffeine, the DMHA... The fat, the hordenine, is it? Yeah. It all goes bang within sort of 15, 20 minutes, and you're like, yeah, you do definitely this. feel that 450 caffeine and that 200 DMHA. That is strong stuff. Yeah. 
and it drives the focus in as well. It is very good at focus. Yeah, hundred percent. It's it's borderline aggressive. I wouldn't call it an aggressive pre worker, but it's it's getting there, yeah. isn't it? It's focus. sort of like it makes you want to keep training hard. Yeah. You have to drag yourself away from the gym. That being said, that's because the mind really does take the focus oh, here. Yeah. Um, the brain's the thing that keeps going. Yeah, Now, very what we productive. both agreed on is there is a slight come down slash yeah. crash. You like slight. And then it sort of tapers after sort of hour and a half. Yeah. Hour. There's obviously nothing in here like decaffeine malate. There's no L-theanine. There's nothing that prolongs those caffeine anhydrous and DMHA. Yeah. So once they're gone, they're gone. They're gone. Um, and we did feel that towards the end when we obviously we did back and biceps for yeah, example heavy today, one. getting towards the end of the biceps, the mind stays stimulated, the focus stays there, the pumps obviously stay there as well. Yeah. But the the energy that the lack the energy starts to die off. You the do physical start energy. To, yeah. Yeah. You do start to come down like a bit. Yeah. Not not the worst we've had, but obviously we've had better in terms of crash. But it's not a flappy stimmy one. You know, no increased heart. Well, no rapid heart rate. Like, but 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 no cold sweats. No none of the unhealthy. Mode. Yeah, it's a productive high stim that we've likened to the likes of Superhuman MV Pre Berserk. Yeah. So super. Yeah, things. like Craig said, Superhuman Supreme Berserk MV Pre Two Point it's in that ballpark Realm, of, yeah. of um, high quality pre workouts that are dialed are, in to training. That are very much on the top borderline of daily driver and in the very bottom of skim junkie. Yeah, yeah. That's the best way I, I put this. I wouldn't really want to use this on a daily basis because of the DMHA dose. And I do think you'd probably get tolerant to that to a degree quite yeah. quite quick. Yeah. Similar to all those other pre-workouts mentioned though. 100%. So what would I say? I'd say this is probably in my top 20, 15, 10 pre-workouts. Which is good when you think that we've tried over 100, I'd say. I was going to say that probably doesn't sound great, but that is actually very good. That's probably in the top 10% of pre-workouts yeah. we've ever had. Yeah. Which is very, very, very good. Which is no surprise when you look at the label, you know, mega clinical doses. They've hit every element, pump, focus, energy. But if we had to really dial in on each factor, we've agreed that we would say energy, focus, pump. With the energy falling throughout the workout. Yeah, and then the pump, and then the focus element sort of goes ahead of the energy. Yeah, yeah. definitely. So pumps are obviously, they're good, but they're not fantastic. Yeah. You do only have the citrulline malate and the creatine monohydrate. Um, but, I, you know, you work into those pumps through the energy. So it's, I say it hits all uh, areas very, very well. Yeah, 100%. And we've come to a score in mind that, that sort of averages out those scores all together. And bearing in mind there's no real negatives, feeling-wise. Mm. No, no survival. Nine out of ten is what we're going to give it. It's a very good pre-workout. I'd be happy taking this Alpha Review Days. Yeah. Um, really solid product. I really do enjoy using Consistent it. Consistent as oh, well. Yeah. You won't have a bad workout on it, that's no, for sure. No, you do get shit done on it. Just yeah. remember there is a slight come down at the end, but nothing extreme. Yeah, no, not super bad. So uh, nine out of ten, very good pre-workout. Thumbs up. Okay, guys, we're going to move into the final verdict of Red, White and Boom H-Bomb version. Do not get the two confused. Yeah. This is the extreme version that is very hard to get hold of these days, but it is doable, so do try. Going to move into each segment as we did in the review. And again, as always, we recommend checking each segment out in full to see how and why we scored them as we did. But we always start off with the taste and the mixability of a product. And we gave that a? 9 out of 10. Very, very nice. Mix fine and it was surprising how nice it was given all the stims. And that was Blue Angels. I can imagine the sour one would be sour very, balls. very nice as well. <laughs> Moving into the price of the product. Now this one again is very discretionary. You know, you may judge this on your actual job income. Yeah. You may judge it on what the pre-work is actually worth. But we gave it a score on our consistent price scale, and that score hit a... 3 out of 10, just scraping the 3 out of 10, mind you, but the effects do justify that price, Exactly, we think. exactly. And the effects, talking of which, most important part of this and any other review, we gave it a... 9 out of 10, smashing score, only coming down on the reasons mentioned. Yeah, very, very, very good all-rounder. Definitely recommend trying it. It has the Review Bro stamp of approval. Um, bear in mind that price, again, discretionary. Yeah. That gives us a total score of... 21. 21 out of 30. Very, very, very good pre-workout. 
you know, again, like I say, it's probably in our top 10% of pre-workouts ever. Yeah. Which counts for a lot. Definitely. So, uh, good stuff, America Labs. Get your hands on it. America, fuck you. Guys, we do hope you enjoyed the review. You know, give us a thumbs up if you could, and please do subscribe if you haven't already. It does mean the world. Helps the channel grow, all the good stuff. Um, we, you know, ask us any questions you've got about the product below. Yeah. Let us know if you've tried it before and let us obviously know what else you want us to get reviewed. You know, we've got a whole bunch behind us that we can't even fit in the camera. It goes up there. Yeah, through the ceiling. <laughs> so, uh, and stacks over there. So um, we've got a lot more coming. So do subscribe. Hit that bell icon for all future reviews to pop up straight away on your phone or computer. Yeah. Um, not much more can be said other than uh, well done to America Labs. Get this at Power Myself Supplements. Yeah. And... Uh, as always, guys, stay steamed and you will hate vomit. <laughs>